<laughs> that was the Moon Quay! Our guest today was actually a celebrity expert and a celebrity makeup artist. He is um, makeup artist to the stars, Jason Kaplan. He's going to give us do's and don'ts on makeup. And, and on the makeup we have on today. Yes, and he's going to tell us if we did okay for our makeup today. So. I'm crossing I didn't my know fingers. I was getting tested today. I might have done a better job. I didn't know I was getting tested either, and I'm wearing bright, fun, bright red lipstick. And in the monitor over here, it looks orange. So is that gonna be your new trademark? Red lipstick? Yeah, because lately every show it's been red lips. I feel like you can get away with a lot with red lips. Like you can wear less eye makeup and just make your red lips pop. Um, anyways, let's invite our guest on, Jason Kaplan. Maybe yeah. he has some perspective on this topic. I was listening to your to your. Um, Synopsis on the wine, and you were saying that it's for spicy rack. Yeah. Well, <laughs> we have two spicy racks here, so it looks it. like I should indulge. All right, so give us the okay. do's and don'ts of makeup. Do's and don'ts of makeup, I think they're pretty easy. And one of the things that I, I always say to myself, and then I'll say it to out, loud, out loud to the people around me, is if you're watching a TV show like High Society or like Gossip Girl or all of these amazing trendy shows where the people are like up to date and up to the pulse of fashion and you think that your makeup is far-fetched from theirs, then you're probably on the wrong track. And these shows like the Jersey Licious, which I love the show, but it's I love it because I love Shark? to make... No, Jersey Licious. Have you not seen that on the Style Network? No. Holy Jesus. I so I think one of the things to do is to pay attention to the things you see on TV that are positive and use that as your influence. But I also can say one thing. If you're going to wear like three products, I think a good bronzer in the right spot. Like don't put a bronzer all over, all your, over your face. face. Because that's not that's not a pretty look. But I think if you just do like the three points, the important points, I'd say like a big three. So like in the contour of your cheek, a little bit on the brow where the sun naturally hits your face. So like here, here, and then a little bit under your jawline. That was the moon quake!